everybody, I'm in the little wood, also known as Martin, got the face cam on today, and welcome back to memory lane, I've got my sapling shit on as well, ah, it's awesome, anyway, welcome back to memory lane, so today, I'm going to show you, I've been showing you a lot of games that you have to buy to play and all that sort of stuff, today, I'm showing you a game that's completely free to play, it's browser based, so you don't have to install anything other than Flash, which we all have, otherwise you wouldn't be watching this, and uh, yeah, that's what you've got to do, so this is one of the games that we had in like school or college, I don't remember exactly which one it was, but you know when you're supposed to be in like, you know, learning how to do an Excel spreadsheet or whatever. I, we were all playing this in our school or college, and this is called Captain Forever. So you'll see the little information bot has just come across over there. And essentially what this is, is you basically got to use the mouse, and you can attach these body parts onto you. It's really, really cool. I absolutely love it. So uh, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to turn down the game audio just a tiny bit. It's quite loud right now. Because I'm actually using, I'm recording this using XSplit because I can't target this with DX Story or anything like that. So I'm having to pop all of these bits onto it. So, I mean, I think the sounds are okay. Let me just check the bars. Uh, yeah, it looks fine. Looks good. Right, so there we go. If I attach a couple more bits like so, there we are. Oh, that's not on. There we go. Cool, so there we go. I've got... Oh my god, they've already come. Okay, that's one thing you need to learn in this game is that if you spend too long actually trying to, like, you know, retrieve things from enemies, then they probably are going to come and kill you. So <laughs> let me just, uh, let me very quickly spin around here. Yeah. Oh, no. I'm trying not to destroy too many of the, um... I'm trying not to destroy too many of the weapons, because otherwise I'm going to be pretty stuck. I mean, that one's got loads on it. It's probably what I want to do, is I want to take out the back ones. Um, there we go, and I take out some of the front. Now, the only thing that you have to protect in this game is essentially just this middle part. Your heart is the thing that you have to protect, so I'm just going to equip a load of these bits. And there we go, I've got a pretty sweet fighter pilot type thing. It's good, because people go with all different sorts of shapes. You'll see some that look like pirate ships. You'll see some which are just like these huge wide lines and they've just absolutely covered in turrets on both sides. But I always prefer to go for more of like a battleship type thing. And uh, another thing to note as well is as well as having the thrusters on the front there, you can actually have them on the sides as well. So when you try turning left and right with the, uh, with the WAS and D, you can actually, you know, do that. And there's a lot of things with like keeping balance and all that sort of stuff. So you'll probably notice right now everything that I have is green and I'm trying to find... A couple more, like, oranges or reds. Because I think the order of colour goes green, yellow, orange, red. And basically, as you move up through those, the weapons get stronger, the thrusters get stronger, um, but also does the weight. So it's a big balancing game. And obviously, if you have, like, more thrusters... it's like So if to say, for example, if my ship had more thrusters on the left-hand side than the right, I would just start spinning in a circle. So when I get attacked later on, you'll probably see an example of that. Uh, now, if I put these guns on either side... I've got some protection for those inner turrets. There we go. And I can probably just whack a turret on there as well. Right, cool. Now, usually, <clears throat> at the very top of this player, uh, there's a little thing that says law. So, essentially, it's kind of like GTA. You, The more bad things that you do, the more ships you take out, the higher the law gets and the tougher the enemies get. Uh, it's not just a matter of, like, venturing out further. You, you, actually have to, um, you actually have to do bits to activate them. So, I'm going to whack a couple of those onto there. Maybe that one's there. There we go. I could probably do a balancing that out. There we go. Now, I do have another thruster there. I suppose I could turn around that way quicker. There we go. Good. And what you'll see as well with the guns, they actually have a higher frequency. So the guns have a higher, uh, you know, speed of shooting. They have a higher power. And by frequency, I mean the sound they actually make, if they do make a sound, gets higher key or higher pitch every time you move up to a different level of them. So I'm just going to see if I can. There we go. There's, uh, I think that's an orange ship, and you can scroll in and out with a mouse button, which is really cool. Ah, this is ideal, because I'm actually shooting him from behind. So, hopefully, I'm not going to take out, I tell you what, if I do this, I'll detach that, and now I can shoot his core straight with my shot. Because your actual, like, heart container actually does quite a bit of damage, um, if I'm honest. I mean, you, you tend to use it in kamikaze missions, you know. If you've been taken out by another ship, you tend to grab a ton of this, and then you go and try and grab the rest of it as well. Uh, now, which way am I going? Uh, what's that? <laughs> ha! That's it! Run, you bastards! According to the chat on that. <laughs> I didn't realise there was any kind of narration around this. Try not to break the gun. Uh, no, no, no. Oh, I broke the gun! That's the one thing I wanted not to do. Right, there we go. And also, as well, uh, not it's not just depending on the number of thrusters that you have that makes you spin in a circle. If you actually have um, different colours as well. So, say you were to have, like, all on the left-hand side, you had yellows and... Oh, my God. Uh, right, I'm going to have to take out the... Uh, 
I don't mind taking out the... That's it. Good, 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 good. There we go. Ooh. Now, there's a ship there. I think he's going to let us upgrade. Right, now let's do some upgrades to it. But actually, yeah, if you have different power levels uh, of thrusters, that can make you go in a circle as well. So it's all about finding a fine balance. It's all about working out what kind of ship shape you can navigate best with. It's, um, yeah, I really like it. It's a really complex but kind of awesome game at the same time. Um, just going to whack a couple more of those on. I can maybe do with protecting my inner part a bit more. I'm just hoping that I'm not putting too much red on that I can't actually, you know, move it and navigate it. Uh, I think that's a red thruster. Have we got any more red ones? No. So I tell you what, I'll put that there. <clears throat> actually, no, I'll put a yellow one there. There we go. If I put the red one there, and I put two orange ones either side of it. Good. Right, so I'm still, I'm pr still pretty swift with my movements. Um, cool. Yeah, that should be right. If I move those up onto there as well. Is someone trying to start on me? Oi! Bugger off! There you go. So you see, after a while, you can absolutely annihilate anybody that comes at you. He's just like, meh! Come at me, bro! Come at me, bro! Oh, oh, snap. Hold on. Not ready! I'm not prepared! No! Hold on. Uh, there we go. I need another yellow thruster. Oi! Oi! Leave my thrusters alone or I will destroy you. There you go. I'll just destroy both of them. Balls to it. There we go. Right, now... I don't even know what shape to go for with this. Should I just keep going outward? <laughs> Let's just keep doing that. Let's just keep going wider and wider and wider. I've seen some absolutely ridiculous ones. I want to see if I can get up to at least blue or purple. Because the colours on those are just incredible. Like, they go all the way up to, like, white and rainbow. And, oh my god, it's it's so good. Uh, I don't, uh, trying not to break the guns. I don't mind breaking everything else as long as I keep the guns. There you go, shoot from this angle. No, no, turn him. That's it, that's it. Oh, no, 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 turn! That's it. <laughs> oh, my God. I don't know when this became Beyblade. That's it. No, no, no. Ah! Oh, he's doing damage to my guns. He's actually taking a couple of them out, I think. There you go. Right. Let's crack some more guns on here, then. Let's put those just either side. I think that'd be good. Green thruster just there. There we go. We've got a pretty sweet ship. Uh, let's not even let him get within range. Right. Come on, then. Where are the big baddies at? That is where a big baddie's at. Right, okay. Let me just, uh... If I put that there, we'll get a bit more protection for my inner guns. There we go. Um, hopefully, I can still move these around pretty pretty well. Uh, there we go. Perfectly balanced. Beautiful stuff. Right, here we go. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Come on. Come on. Destroy the base. Destroy the center of it. Yes, there we are. Yellow thruster, anyone? Uh... I mean, if I had two yellow thrusters, I could put them either side for a quicker turn in. All right, let's go after this bad boy, then let's spec him out. So he's got guns at the back. Actually, his back is completely exposed. So as long as I don't stand in line, which I have just gone and done, that was the stupidest thing I could have done. Oh, God. That's it. Take out the core. Take out the core. Take out the core. Come on. Take out the core. I've got him hooked. Yes. Did I do it? I did it. What do you want? <laughs> what do you actually want? Oh, I shouldn't be doing that. I should be keeping the guns. Hold on. Let's put the main gun in the middle. There we are. That's good. Right. Uh, now, what was I looking for? We've still got another gun there. Oh, there's another big gun just there. Hold on a second. There you go. Right. Okay, cool. Let me bring that gun over there. Right. So what I want to do is I want to put... Let's put the purple guns in the center at the front. Because they've got the best armor coverage. There we go. Oh, no. I broke it. Right. There we go. Now what am I doing? Uh... Because the thing is, is that you can actually shoot yourself as well. So, if you put on too many of these... Oh, bugging me. Oh, bloody hell. Uh, side gun. Back. That there. Uh, is that... That's completely unbalanced, isn't it? Is that now balanced? I mean, obviously the guns. The guns don't really do much to the weight. It's more so just the blocks. Oh, oh. What? Oh, no, I thought you had a piece of purple on there. I was like, what the hell? Where'd you get that from? Uh... Can you hear now that little chime that I've got? I think that's due to my purple guns. So I tell you what, let me just annihilate these guys over here. There we go. He can't do any more damage to us, which is good. There you are. Let's keep building up this outer layer. Um, I tell you what, let's just keep going wide with it. There we go. Let's put an orange thruster there. Are there any more orange thrusters in the immediate area? No, I don't think there is. Okay, good. So we've got those. Beautiful. Now, where am I going? Where am I going? Where am I going? Uh, oh, we got that thing there. What's that? That's a yellow thruster. 
Did I need... Oh, no, I needed an orange one. I suppose yellow and orange aren't two worlds apart. Yeah, I'm not noticing too much navigation issues with that. Ah, see, this one's for easy pickings. This one is literally just like, thanks for your bits. See you later, bro. Really, I'm just after the gun and maybe the... Maybe the propulsion as well. There you go. Nice. Nice. Right. That there. I don't remember what's stronger, pink or purple. Don't remember. I'm going to put purple on because it's definitely stronger than red anyway. So let's do that. Purple gun in the middle. Those at the top. No, top. Oh, actually, maybe they can go down the side. Yeah, that looks nice. And then we put that there. We've got a red thruster as well, which we could train in for something. Uh... No, no, I think we're good. I think we're good. Right, okay. This is probably one of the better runs I've been on. I've gotten up to, like, the big colours before, but that's only, like, once. And that was only because I went on a kamikaze mission as well. Oh, no, I need that. Sorry. Just move the debris out of the way. Debris? Debris? I don't know. I don't know how you pronounce it. <laughs> but I took it away, the debris. Because I annihilate any ship coming at me. Right. So I need to keep an eye out. Ooh, okay, okay. Oh my god, yep, he's got some pretty sweet shots. I can see my whole ship taking a beat in here. So I'm just going to try and stay on him, as in like stay hooked on the side of him. Because here I should be relatively safe. Stick on him, stick, don't let him turn, don't let him turn too much. That's it, got it, got it, got it. That's got to be the centre. Done, come on. Yes! Woo! Look at that little ship at the back. He's just like, oh hey, guys. oh, hey, guys. What's going on? You fighting over here? Good. Good. Make love, not war, man. Make love. All right, here we go. So we've got some of those. I've got a ton of guns now. My goodness. All right, there we are. Uh, why is that one bent in and that one isn't? It's very strange. Hmm. Right, I tell you what. So those can go there. I'll put some more... Some more wear, some more wear, some more wear. I tell you what, let's put that sideways. Take that off there. There we go. I don't know what I'm doing with the shape of this right now. <laughs> I haven't got a clue. We've got some blue propellers as well, which is very much needed. We'll put those on the outer part. So actually, yeah, if we put those there. There we go. Right, blue, red, yellow, yellow, orange. Blue, red, yellow, yellow, orange. And then we've got a purple one in the middle, which is good. Uh, now we just need... Uh, what are you doing? Bugger off, man. There you go. Oh, there's a big ship there. Okay, I think I could take him. I think I got this. Uh, let's put those up. Nope. Protect him. Protect the walls. Protect the walls. Now, you can actually equip stuff whilst you're moving. You see how I turn there? Oh, is that a... Oh, it's a crystal ship. No. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, this is going to be the end for me, I think. I think this is going to be the end. I mean, I can... Worst case scenario, I would detach everything that I have on me just to go to that middle part. Oh, my God. This is not happening. Oh, I'm being attacked from the side. I think that's going to be me done. <laughs> no. No. Come on. Come on. I can do this. I'm so off balance right now. It hurts. Oh, no. No. <laughs> oh, no. Boop. <laughs> so there we go that's one round of captain forever uh, i'm not going to play it over and over and over again because otherwise i would literally be here for an entire hour but there you go that's the best ship that i made now one thing that you can do is you can actually tweet them you can get the physical link you can embed them onto bb code forums all stuff like that so you can actually carry on playing from this point but the problem is is that when you carry on from this point you don't get another save later on it's pretty much you get one save and that's it so obviously this isn't the best ship in the world i'd want to get up to at least crystal to then you know do the other bits and i don't even know if there's an end game i've never seen the end game i think maybe you just get all the white stuff and the heavenly and the rainbow stuff and that's it but uh but yeah if you want put links in the um oh, actually no no not in the description not in the chat uh put links on facebook and on twitter and show me the best ships that you've come up with don't just google them either i want to know that you've done it legit so uh so yeah thank you very much for watching everybody and i shall see you all in a little bit Bye!